emissions down to zero. This is exciting. I to have two great Rhode Island companies. Yeah. with wind it, that people talk about a lot is you can't store it, you know, and, when, uh, and, and so a lot of the strategy and thinking ahead looking down the road 10 years from now is that the batteries represented by all of these vehicles, if we get lots of them that are battery powered and electric, they become the storage capacity, if you will, because these things, for all of us that will have them, you charge them at night uh, when uh, the energy demand is the least, but wind usually is pretty good at night. Uh, so the tie-in here, I think, is fantastic. Uh, and, and I'm very excited to see, as I said, two great Rhode Island companies taking a leadership position here because at the end of the day, for these vehicles to become more, uh, more prevalent, I need to have facilities to be able to charge them. The question we always get is why a moving company? You know, why would we be doing this? We started um, two years ago transforming our company with the help of an environmental consultant too, actually, to redo everything we do. E every piece of material we want recycled, we want emissions down to zero, everything we do we want to change. We want to transform this company into the next 110 years. We're 110 years old, but we know we can't be the same company the next 110 years. Arpen Renewable Energy focuses on changing transportation, adding solar panels to trucks. When we saw the arc, we said, oh my God, this is transportation, and this needs to be done. We need to change to hybrids, electrics, plug-ins, and the only way we're going to do it is to install these and buy these vehicles. And so we got behind it, and we came to the Cardis, and we said, you know what? Let's be the impetus. Let's get this done. Let's put the first one in. There's a tremendous organization here called Project Get Ready, and you can see the stats, how many they want to put in. We know President Obama wants a million electric cars on the road in three years. It has to start somewhere. So my thanks to the team, to the Cardis, to the governor, and to everybody here, and let's, let's go electric, okay? Thank you.